travel back in time and walk through the Jurassic era when dinosaurs roamed the earth. Ashley Williams hanging out at Cal Expo with more. Give me a Velociraptor impression. Do you know where? <laughs> <laughs> Let me work on that. But this is, in fact, you guys, the biggest traveling show in North America. Now, a little bit later, we're going to take you to some of the really cool scenes that they have over yonder. But right now, we're going to talk all things fossils. Now, before we do that, though, I have a surprise for you. Take a look at that. Any idea what you think this could possibly be, Tina and Camby? Let's see. Um, what is that supposed to be? It's dinosaur poop. That's what it I was going to say. Poop Stop it. Right here. But in I didn't my want to. hand. Look how oh, large wow. that is. <laughs> All right. Now, this is Nick. Nick, you are a fossil expert. You're is? also one of the what? many uh, tour guides right here uh, at Cal Expo for this traveling show. First of all, this is uh, people love coming here. Why do people love coming to Jurassic Quest so much? Oh, absolutely. So, yeah. So, dinosaurs capture people's imaginations, both young and old alike. It's because we, you know, these animals that really existed, but they're so, so different from anything alive today. Um, oh, sorry. So yeah, so we have animals from from different time periods: the Triassic, the Jurassic, and the Cretaceous. And th these were alive for over 165 million years on the, roaming this planet. I mean, I feel like I'm learning so much. I've only been here even just for a few minutes. Okay, so we're gonna talk you or walk you through rather some of the life-size skulls that we have right here. Um, let's start here. This is a Tylosaurus. How do you even say that? Yeah, so so Tylosaurus pr prorigger. It's it's a. Okay. It's a uh, it's a t type of marine reptile. So it's, so it's an animal lived at the same time as dinosaurs, although technically not a dinosaur itself. Yeah. This individual is about 45 feet long and discovered in Kansas, and wow. it's the largest mosasaur found in North America. It's a member of the mosasaur family that that's, that a uh, lot, lot of kids love mosasaurs. Yeah. And I want to put things in perspective really quick, size-wise. This is obviously just the skull, just the head. Now this is probably exactly two arm lengths, my arms at that. So this is obviously large. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Long. huge. Okay, let's um, keep walking. Then. Oh yeah, so another mosasaur is this guy here called a prognathodon. It's a member here. Yep. Okay. It's a member of the mosasaur family as well. They had thicker, they had the thickest teeth of any type of mosasaur and the thickest jaws, so they were great for crushing stuff. They actually find bits of sea turtle inside their stomach. And like all mosasaurs, like even like that guy, there's a row of teeth they have in the very back of their mouth. For, for chewing its stuff back okay. up there. No, no, I would probably say T Rex is probably the most, at least for me, it's the one dinosaur that I remembered as a kid. Uh, probably one of the most popular. So I want to show folks at home the T Rex skull, life size, mind you, T Rex skull. Yeah, so this is Stan the T Rex. So, so Stan had the most intact skull of any T Rex ever found. It's actually molded from a skull that was found in South Dakota. Wow. And what's really cool about Stan, he's got a lot of injuries and a lot of holes in his skull that actually match up to the two teeth marks from another T-Rex. Oh, so, wow. so Stan got into a fight here at some point, but he survived because he had, a lot of the holes are actually partially healed. So he actually walked off from those fights. Nick, this is so fantastic. Now, the good news is you're not going anywhere. Neither are we because we're going to stick around for another hour and, again, take you back to over some of the scenes and the acts. We're talking 100 life-size replicas of dinosaurs right here at Cal Expo. So they open the doors at 9 a.m. Come on out, have some fun, check it out, but stay with us because we're going to have a little more fun. And Camby, I'm going to work on my noises. I'm going to work on that for you. Yeah, she wants you to work on the noises. Arr. All right, sounds good. Thank you. There's nothing like enjoying